Chinese in tradition here. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> oh, look at this guy. Look at those coconut heads. What the heck? Oh, no, they're, they're coming, they're, they're coming. coming! No, 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 no! <laughs> Is he still drunk? I, I don't know who book am I? He looks uh, drunk! Yeah. It's about 11.50 right now and 12 o'clock the parade is gonna start. So the festival should be starting really soon. But uh, it's been raining quite a bit today and they were saying Hopefully, it's gonna stay like this because if it starts pouring, they have to cancel everything. So hopefully, we're gonna have the same decent weather. Now, a little bit of history about this uh, festival. It started actually in 1920, so it's a very old one. But uh, it's not really about um, spirits and getting the monsters away. It's more of just good vibes in this town. So each year, it kind of evolves into something new and different but this year it's all free for all so let's try to do some shots and catch some good moments by the way i've been getting so many bites here check this one out i think that's a bee stink then i just received one over here this morning all right got my mosquito repellent on so i'm ready to go you can definitely tell people are gathering up now take a look at the crowd we got kulas and junjun over there <laughs> Let's catch up with them. What the heck? These look like zombie! Zombie monsters! I guess it's starting! <laughs> I don't know why there's so many gays here, but that's hilarious! Oh, cool. 
Iceland's festival. It's amazing. Look at the costumes. <laughs> and these guys. This is hilarious. All right, start the party rain. These girls here are saving me under the umbrella because I don't want to wear my camera. But it's boring right now. absolutely hilarious. It's funny how they can mix like a traditional thing with uh, just a uh, humor and funniness and all that in the same parade. But now we're going back over there. That's where the uh, end of the parade is. Now we're entering the uh, final part of the parade. This is where they're all going to gather up. You can see there's a massive crowd. Our showdown. Give me a showdown. It's a showdown, baby. But now <laughs> <laughs> showdown. That's going to be interesting. Let's go. Learn the stage. <laughs> <laughs> so what's gonna happen now, all these uh, parties of costumes, they're gonna go onto the floor, they're gonna have a competition, it's gonna be dancing, singing, and then there's referees over there, they're gonna judge which one is gonna win. It's Baranga, they're bringing in their costumes, this entry one is a float fairy, check it out. It's entry number three. Alright, here we go. Whoa! These are the uh, disco guys. They must have practiced forever. That was like four minutes of dancing Next with no instructor. It's entry number two. How typical Philippines. Pineapple bag right here. What's really impressive about this festival is not even promoted. It's completely local here in Northwest Indianapolis. Well, that's it from this.
this festival. It's been an amazing one. I wasn't expecting this many costumes or performance. That was brilliant. The good vibes, the people here, they're so friendly, they're so funny. Everyone's having a blast, even if it's a January 1st. Usually that's when people are hungover, but here everyone's in good spirit. <laughs> Who last taking pictures, of course. But we're off now. I think we're gonna have a food or something. And we'll see. Maybe we'll call it a day. If not, peace out.